Australian actor Hugh Jackman, along with fashion designer Donna Karen and fashion photographer Russell James, recently held an exhibit at Karen's Studio New York. The show featured a unique blending of art, which is symbolic of the mood of reconciliation between the Aboriginal Australians and white Australians. It's about reconciliation, and it's about and art. Art can break down barriers. We're on the we're on the path of healing right now, and this is a, a great step forward. The event was inspired by Australian government's apology to the stolen generation last year. Donna Karen, who has visited the country several times, believes the apology to have been an important step to take in reconciliation. You know, we're so busy looking at the future, you know, and saying what's new, what's new, what's new, particularly, you know, in the worlds that we live in, that sometimes we have to reflect back because we would not be who we are today if it weren't for the past and the abuse that sometimes is handled. I'm a parent. Everyone knows that's common sense. You do something wrong, you've got to say sorry. How do you begin? So we've, we've got a long way to go. Dumb the Nomad Two Worlds exhibit, the show features the photography of Russell James mixed with the artwork of Aboriginal artist Clifton Biondury. The photos featured in the show are of sites and artifacts that are of cultural significance to the Indigenous Australians and have been embellished with signature Aboriginal art techniques like cross-hatching and dotting. To the artist, Rudd's apology was a way of facing the past with an honesty that had never been expressed by the Australian government. Australia, as a, as on a political front, was paralysed with fear. We had a government for 12 years that refused. They'd use words like regret. And it led to such a conflict and such a troubled feeling amongst the Indigenous people um, when it was so clear there was genocide, there was atrocities, there was forced relocation of the children. Professor Fiona Stanley runs an organization called the Telethon Institute for Child Health Research, which is a leading research group dedicated to solving the health problems facing the Aboriginal people. Stanley hopes that Jackman Star Power will add a much needed spotlight to the cause. I think basically that people don't understand that this is not a simple problem, that this is a complex problem that's built up over many years of marginalisation of Aboriginal people from our society. So it's actually a, not an Aboriginal problem. It is actually a marginalisation problem. The exhibition Nomad Two Worlds was organised by Donna Karen's Urban Zen Foundation. The project has involved years of groundwork in the remote regions of northwestern Australia in the spirit of reconciliation, senior indigenous custodians provided access to sites of great cultural significance to the Aboriginal people. TITV Weekly.